What do the luminiferous ether, phlogiston, crystalline spheres, and the homunculus have in common? None of them ever actually existed, but belief in their reality held up progress, like dragons on the edges of a map, discouraging exploration. The reinvention of science. Slaying the dragons of dogma and ignorance contains an extensive history of how science evolved through controversy, suppression, and the wish to maintain the status quo. How did the authors know each other? Student Bernard Jones first encountered postdoc Virginia Trimble in the early 70s at the Institute of Theoretical Astronomy in Cambridge. At this time, co-author Vicente Martinez was at the primary school. Student Vicente Martinez then encountered Professor Jones, who became his advisor in 1986 at Nordita and the Niels Bohr Institute in Copenhagen. And Professor Trimble encountered Dr. Martinez as his junior co-organizer of a September 2000 summer school on historical development of modern cosmology in Valencia. Our story passes from the Babylonians and Greeks through the Middle Ages, the Renaissance and the scientific revolution to current events. The authors discuss the evolution of our knowledge, the controversy about the extinction of dinosaurs, and open questions in contemporary science such as dark matter, dark energy, black holes, and the origin of the universe, including how we understand the subatomic world of elementary particles. What happens when three astronomers at the forefront of their field pause to look back at the origins of all they know? The result, the reinvention of science, calls to mind the Voyager spacecraft's photo of the Earth as a pale blue dot taken at a distance of nearly four billion miles from the sun. Here in these pages, the authors lead the reader through the ideas that have brought us from mythology to the brink of dark matter. Dava Sobel.